Come up with a kind of killer, killer, This young love will get in me for my brother. Hello beautiful people, happy Friday. No, <laughs> it's not Friday, it's Thursday. But yeah, how are you guys doing? We are actually going to my girl Alice's house. She's hosting like a cute little like festive night at her house, like Christmas themed get together. So it's gonna be really cute. Everyone's just coming super comfy. I think one of my friends is wearing pajamas. So I'm just wearing this dress. Oh, it's really dark. So I don't know if you guys can properly see. It's just like a knitted, Dress. It's got a little slit on the side and I'm just pairing it with this cardigan so that it's just like cute, homely, you know, comfortable. I think I'm literally going to wear it with Crocs just because we're just chilling in our house. But yeah, it should be a good time. My girl is coming to pick me up and we're going to drive to her house. So yeah, it should be a cute night. I'm excited. See you guys when we get there. Guys, here's a better view of my outfit and better lighting. So let's go dress in the cardigan. Born king! Oh, oh, thank you! Come through! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> we told Ola that we're carol singers, that's why we're singing at our doorstep. Welcome! <laughs> yes, please! Thank you, my darling! Welcome! It's just coming to the big fashion go, look let today. Go, let it go, In her... <laughs> what, is, what is this? Gingerbread? Gingerbread no. lady! No, no not man! Oh, lady! Lady! lady. Now watching a Dad, Christmas I movie. Was a project next. We're watching <laughs> Noel's Diary. Let's see how it goes. It's now time to eat, and everyone's queuing beautiful. up. We're <laughs> <laughs> literally queuing up for dinner as if we're in prison. <laughs> <laughs> Now time to eat, guys. The food looks so good. Guys, the movie is just like so funny. Do you know when it's like so cringe, but like in a good way? Like we were still enjoying it, and we're just like taking the make out of the movie. Do you think? I think you should never like watch Christmas movies and think it's gonna be a serious watch. Like you just have to watch it knowing it's just gonna be like completely unrealistic. But you know what? Something that is annoying me though is how they're like romanticizing cheating. Like I don't really want to explore the plot, but there is some sort of like cheating that goes on, and it's like. What you guys are doing is not cute. Like, you can't just kiss the next man when you've got a fiance. And it's like, I'm extra triggered because I've got a fiance. So it's like, why are they trying to make it all romantic that this girl's trying to cheat on her man? Like, anyway, that's kind of weird. But yeah, having a really great time with my girlies. I'm so happy that we did this. It's so nice to just hang out, chat, and just be cute. So yeah, I'm gonna go and eat my food. Ola is literally the best host. beautiful people so i'm now home guys we had such a good time like it was just so nice to just hang out with my girls like sometimes when you hang out with your girls when you're like out and about and you know doing stuff you don't really get to like just chill and talk absolute rubbish and just laugh your heads off about dumb stuff and it was so much fun like we watched the lamest movie on earth but it was just so good because we just got to laugh at it and <laughs> Guys, that movie is so whack like zero cap it's so whack but it's kind of like whack like an enjoyable type of whack it's so bad it's kind of good <laughs> it was really it was a really great evening but basically on my way back home i remembered that i literally had like three different things that i had to do tonight that i did not get done because you know i obviously have a nine to five but then i also have my own like content creation career i basically have to like do my nine to five and then after my nine to five get that work done but this evening in particular i have two sets of deadlines that i'm working with brands on so one brand was like if you can get this back to me oh actually was it in this vlog that i shot that content i don't know if it's gonna be in this vlog or my last vlog but earlier this week i worked with an amazing makeup brand Too Faced. they really liked my content that i did for them they just wanted me to like make a, a few changes so they basically said to me that they made some like little adjustments i have to edit but they want that back by the morning and i was like okay that's fine and then another brand that i work with weekly i do like weekly posts with them i also told them that i was gonna get my outfit post with them by this evening 
Okay, cool. This evening, it's now 1 a.m. and I haven't done it. Cool. I have my Too Faced video to edit and send. I have my outfit post to edit and send for approval that I told them I'll get done tonight. And then I'm also working on the edits of my next YouTube video. And yeah, I really, really, really want to be consistent on YouTube again just because I love this app so much. So that's three things to do. Um, I have work again at 9 a.m. But it's currently 1 a.m. I was literally about to get into bed because I was so tired. I was like, no, Grandy, we're not getting into bed. We have ish to do. And I know myself, if I tell myself, don't worry, you're just gonna wake up early and get it done before 9 a.m. There's a possibility that I won't do that. I will hear my alarms and snooze them all and have to wake up at 8.58 to start work at 9. So, in order for me to balance my 9 to 5 and my content creating, tonight I'm thinking I have to just stay up and get this done. Yeah, I just really don't want to make excuses for myself. I just want to be that girl. In my life, I've just been in the pursuit of becoming that girl for so long. I just want to be her. And I feel like that girl right now wouldn't go to sleep. She'd get her work and she got to sleep. And I'm going to feel so good about myself if I literally had a really lovely evening with my girl but then also got my work done do you know what i mean not having a really great evening with my girls and then just have all these brands emailing me tomorrow like where's the content where's this and i'm just like i was out with my girls i didn't get to do them do you know what i mean i've rambled for so long sorry guys but yeah and also my other idea was to do this work from my bed yeah that wasn't gonna happen if i was gonna sit in my bed like as soon as i would sit there to like start doing my work i know i'll just be like <gasps> falling asleep so i'm actually sitting at my desk you can't really see it it's a bit messy but i'm sitting at my desk i think i'm gonna listen to one of my favorite songs get my blood pumping and then i'm gonna start working but yeah guys if you want to balance you gotta make some sacrifices you might have to sacrifice sleep but yeah man let's be that girl and get our flipping work done okay so right now it's 1 a.m 1 a.m I would love to be done with everything by like 3 a.m. 3.30. So yeah, I'm gonna check in back with you then and see how much we get done. Love you. Update guys, it's 2.55 a.m. and I'm about to send off email. Let's do it together. Sent. So that is my first piece of content done. I'm so happy guys, I'm so proud of myself. This has taken a bit longer than I expected, but everything always takes longer than I expected, to be honest. So the first piece done, I'm so happy. Now I have to sort out my YouTube video. Let's do this. Guys, who even is she right now just ticking stuff off her to-do list? I'm just about to tick off the second thing on my to-do list. I'm currently exporting my vlog. Look at the little exporting thing. Let's see it. 0.3, 0.4. I can't even believe I've done this. Like, guys, it's so weird. Like, when you are like tired and you don't want to do something productive, you're just like I just want to sleep there's no way I can do anything right now I just need to sleep considering guys I got in last night I got in last night at like 2 a.m went to work at 9 a.m was up from 7 a.m to go to work so anyway I've been up for a very long time the fact that I pushed through it's like I ma I've managed to do this like you can be so tired but then you can still manage to get stuff done if you just like push yourself and don't allow your brain to tell you that you can't do it like my brain was telling me baby girl go to sleep but then I was like no I don't want to go to sleep so yeah <laughs> So happy this video is exporting. That's the second task of my to-do list. Done. Now I'm gonna do the third thing of my to-do list. Third and final thing. This one is like not. I mean, it, to be fair, it is important. So I should still. I should do this. Okay. This one. I'm gonna do it now. This one shouldn't take me too long as well. It's now 3:53. I should be done with this at around 4:15. 4.15, 4.20 and then I can sleep for like 4.20, 5.20, 6.20, 7.20, 8.20 and I have like four and a half hours sleep. We're ready to work at night. That is how the heart goes through it. So yeah, third and final task of the day is edit some Instagram pictures. I love these pictures that I took. But yeah guys, third and final task. So I made a little to-do list. So it says send content, export video, and then edit pictures. So let's tick them off together. The first one, 
I sent that email. Boom. And then I'm currently exporting the video. Boom. And now I just have to edit pictures. There's nothing more satisfying than just ticking something off to do list. Like, oh, love it. But yeah, let me edit these pictures now. See you in a little bit. Guys, I have finished my task for the morning. I can finally tick off my last one. Can you see that? It says edit pictures. Boom. Done. I did it. Now it's time to sleep for a few hours. But yeah, guys, I'm so happy that I pushed through and did this. Like, but yeah, now it's time to go to sleep so that I can wake up and have a working from home day. See you in the morning. Hi, guys. Good morning. It's Friday. Happy Friday. So, guys, it actually hasn't been long since I was last sat at this desk. But yeah, last time you guys saw me, I finished all my work and i went to sleep i didn't sleep for that many hours <laughs> but it's gonna be all good um oh my god i'm so lucky in the building we have a coffee machine i checked and we ran out of milk to make coffee and then i was like what am i gonna do and i remember downstairs we have a free coffee machine so we can just go downstairs at any time and make a coffee or hot chocolate literally one of the best part of living in this building i made myself a double espresso shot because we finna need that energy baby and i also got this hot chocolate the hot chocolate they do here guys mm, 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 mm. so good so 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 good yeah. today is my last working day of the week oh i actually have a long weekend this weekend because i booked monday off work because we are going to be in manchester one of our friends throws these events they're called formal day parties i've never been to them before so i'm so excited the last one the last one looked unreal my brother is a videographer and he's the one who actually shot the last event and the event literally just looked insane like it looked like so much fun all the girls were coming through with the looks so i'm so excited to like go and like dress up and look cool as heck because you know sometimes like when you go out and you just don't want to wear like a heels you don't wear like heels and a dress like so it's just like meh i'm kind of like over that i've kind of just been in a phase where i've just been over the whole like wearing heels and dresses and like mini dresses to go out like no i don't want to do that i want to wear like boots i want to wear cargoes i want to wear cool fits i want to look like a cool girl when i go out i want to have my shades on <laughs> i want to be that girl when i go out and basically all the girls at one of his parties all of them just look so freaking cool so i'm excited to like dress up look cool have a good time go to a different city it's gonna be so fun it's gonna be a good group of us going as well like six of my friends and my fiance is also coming so that's gonna be so fun anyway that's on Sundays so that's why I booked Monday off work so I'm gonna be off work for a long weekend this weekend Saturday Sunday Monday but yeah guys we're back to the grind this morning I'm doing my nine to five Fridays we get to work from home yay yeah I love the fact that my job you get two days working from home but to be fair like I actually really love being in the office at my job too like the office is so nice everyone there is so cool like you're not like in the office and you know like the whole corporate vibe when you have to just do like fake laughs and you have to like change your breath like, do you know those memes that came out when people would like get into their car after their nine to five and then they'd have to like take off all this like corporate stuff and then put on their shades and i'll be like guess who's back <laughs> yeah like but i can actually say like i'm so lucky in my job like everyone's so cool i'm so myself at work like i don't have to feel like i have to act differently to fit in or anything like that but yeah i actually really like being in office but just being able to like stay at home for two days is so good because then i don't have to commute and i can just save that commuting time and i can just be in the comfort of my home who doesn't want to be in their house on a friday so yeah we are working from home today and then 5 p.m the turn up begins i think i'm gonna go to the now shop at five because oh, i've had an accident um you guys might have seen that i got my own natural nails i got gel for the first time i actually loved how the nails came out they just came out so dainty and cute guys and look these are like my own nails but literally it's been like two days and my own nail is literally like breaking off like it's almost halfway cracked so then i put sellotape on to save it and i'm gonna go back to the nail shop and ask them to like sort my nail out because it's a really it's a fresh set it's only been for like two days so i'm just gonna sort that out i think i'm gonna go there at five i'm gonna come back and i have to get ready because we are literally all the girls that i was with yesterday we're all going out again today um we're doing a birthday dinner for my baby girl and we haven't been out to dinner if it hasn't been that long it's been like two weeks since we've all been out that's gonna be a really good night 
don't know what I'm wearing actually so I probably need to figure that out but yeah guys we have got a huge to-do list for the day ahead so let's get cracking honey I'll see you guys when my working day is done and we can just like let loose and turn up period hey guys the working day is now done it's officially the weekend besties so I am out of here I'm going to go and get my nail fixed that's what I need to do. Um, I was gonna allow it and just like not get it done, but it's like I don't wanna be that girl that's got a freaking piece of cellar tape on her hand. Like, I don't wanna be that girl. I wanna be a hot girl. Do you know what I mean? Like, I just wanna be a hot girl who doesn't have cellar tape on her finger. So I'm going to get it fixed and I'm gonna come back, start getting ready, and have a little girl's night out. Guys, I love Em. Like, she's my whole heart, and it's so crazy because she's actually like a new friend. Like, I've literally only known her for maybe a year or less, but as soon as we met her, like, instantly she became part of our friendship group because she's like the sweetest girl ever and it's just so nice to like still be able to like gain new friendships as an adult like it's actually really really nice but yeah she's such a babe she's just been a fresh new addition to our friendship group and we just love her but yeah unfortunately she's actually Mm. Hey, my neighbour just came out of this flat. But unfortunately, she's actually leaving us. She's leaving us to go to bloody London, isn't she? She's going down to bloody London. Can't believe it. So yeah, but I'm absolutely buzzing for her, guys. I don't know why I just changed my accent. <laughs> but yeah, she's moving to London. She's got a new job, so I'm so happy for her. But yeah, we're just gonna miss her loads. So tonight we're celebrating. We're celebrating her birthday. We're gonna surprise her as well with a cake. So that's gonna be a super cute little surprise. Um, and she's such like a good friend. Like for everyone's birthdays, she always like goes in, she always gets everyone presents. And to be honest, I haven't got her anything. So I actually need to figure out what I'm gonna get her. I can, this is an early birthday dinner. Her birthday is actually on the 9th. So I have like a week until her actual birthday, kind of figure out what I wanna get her. But I have to get her something because she's like just the sweetest girl ever. But yeah guys, heading to get my nail fixed. I don't even know what they're gonna do because it's my actual nail that's broken. So it's like, what are they gonna do? Are they just gonna put an acrylic over the top? But the whole point is that I don't wanna be an acrylic babe anymore. I wanna be a natural nail girly. So maybe they can just glue it back together. I have no idea, but they better pat me because that is not acceptable. That like two days later, my nails are breaking off. To be fair, that it probably is because I've literally had acrylics for like years now. So my nails underneath, they're quite soft and weak. They're not very hard. So that was probably why they broke. But yeah, I really love them at the nail shop. I'm sure they're gonna sort me out. But yeah, guys something else i have to think about is what am i wearing tonight what am i actually wearing i want to be a cool girl i want to be a hot girl i want to be everything at once i'm really like thinking like what am i gonna wear but yeah i'm just gonna walk as i rack my brain as to what the heck i'm gonna wear but yeah see you later hey guys finally time to get ready i got back from doing my nails and then i started planning an outfit and then everything just took ages and now <laughs> I have 30 minutes to leave the house. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed because I thought tonight it was gonna be a cute little have a drink, get ready, be cute, listen to music. I thought it was gonna be that kind of night, but it's not. It's a manic, panicked, get ready type of night. But I think, do you know what it was? Picking an outfit just took longer than I thought, but I love my outfit, so it's cool. <sighs> I have 30 minutes to do my hair and makeup. Oh my god, I actually have 24 minutes. Yeah, we're definitely going late, it is what it is. Realistically, guys, I'm not leaving 30 minutes. I'm not. I just, I'm just not. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm gonna probably leave this house when the dinner reservation has started. I hate being late to stuff, but it's just that it is what it is. We need to tell the birthday girl to not even like show up yet because M is like always so on time to everything. So I just don't want her to be the first one there. Anyway, let's do our freaking makeup, besties. <laughs> Yeah, he looks stunning by the way. Finally arrived with the gorgeous girls. Yes, please. So, guys, they 
tried to prank us when we got here. They tried to like act all mean and like stush. They tried to act like they were angry with us being late. So we got here, Gratz like was being so hostile. I was like, oh my god, like what's the vibe? And then like they broke down and said that they were trying to prank us that um, they were angry that we were late. But I don't think they really committed. Gratz was like, Gratz actually, you actually seemed like you were angry. The rest were just like vibing. <laughs> dinner it was so lovely celebrating yeah, M but yeah I think we're gonna try and find another spot to go well, to Ethan, song so let's see that. let's see what the vibe is we're trying to go oh to Milano's yeah. Milano's is like the one uh, the popping popping ish spot in our city so yeah we're going there my feet are hurting these boots are just for fashion these boots are not comfy in the slightest but I'm serving looks and that's all that matters these are all the gorgeous girlies Hello beautiful people, happy Saturday or otherwise known as happy Ashake day. Um, today guys we are seeing Ashake in concert. If you don't know who he is, he's like one of the best artists right now. Like he's killing it so much and I'm so excited for his concert tonight. It's gonna be so much fun guys. When I say this weekend is jam packed, like it's literally jam packed. But yeah, I've literally been waiting for this concert for weeks now. Oh my God. It's gonna be so fun. We are hostesses with the most hostesses today because a bunch of our friends are actually coming from different cities and we're all hosting them. There's gonna be like five people sleeping here. So yeah, right now our mission is to tidy up, make sure the place looks cute. And guys, it's so funny because Spotify, Spotify Wrapped came out and Spotify Wrapped is basically like, like a compilation of who was like your most listened to artist, like through everything that you played for last year. And then it will tell you like, what was your most played song? What was your favorite artist? artist and mine came out like yesterday and my top artist guys guess who it is obviously it's a shake who i'm gonna see so when i saw that i was like it makes sense because i'm literally going to his concert like tomorrow so yeah well, currently we are tidying up we're just we're just being you know me me the maids sometimes you gotta just be me with the maid real quick okay in your little do rag so that's a vibe right now i'm just gonna tidy hey yo let me take the ass back to the club real quick touch it bring it paid watch it turn it leave it start formatted touch it bring it paid watch it turn it leave it start formatted touch it bring it paid watch it turn it leave it start formatted touch it bring it paid watch it turn it leave it Hey guys, so it's been a few hours since we last spoke. I was just tidying up, getting the house ready for all my guests, and a few of them have actually arrived. But right now, I need to get ready for the evening. I am actually came to do my makeup in my bathroom because yesterday I realized the lighting in my bedroom is so bad. So that's why my makeup didn't really hit like that yesterday. But today I've come to do it in the bathroom, so hopefully it turns out cuter. So yeah, I'm actually just gonna show you the before and after of my glam. So this is before, this is how we're looking. And I'm gonna be glam in three, two, one. 
and we are ready really love 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 how my beat turned out today Ooh, she's giving i don't think i like my outfit guys i'm quite upset because i've worn this outfit loads of times before and it's always looked good but today i don't know what's wrong with it but it's too late to even change guys we need to like get going soon so i'm committed it is what it is. I'm wearing this. That's it. But yeah, should be a fun time. Before I go out, I've been commissioned by Mel to take some photos of her. She's putting me to work. Thank you so much. Let's get this pic, honey. You thought I was feeling you? No, I was feeling you. That nigga munch. Nigga, either he ate it for lunch. To my baddie, I get what I want. Like, guess me like that on me. That is what you should have been. We secured the pic in about 30 seconds flat and I saw her period because she's a hot girl. She don't take long to take pics. What? You think she gonna take long? She don't need long. I'm sorry, but this beat, who is she? My beat is so freaking good today. Guys, these are our outfits of the night. There's more girls here, but they're taking pictures and stuff. So we're just gonna show you that out. This is my outfit of the night. I'm wearing these Balenciaga boot dupes from Mango. I'm wearing my Zara skirt and this top is because of Alice. Ooh. Um, Ooh. My silver bag. Next! <laughs> I've got my ego boots and this is Pretty Little Thing, Pretty Little Thing and this is from Grandis Wardrobe. <laughs> so guys, I'm wearing all Missy Empire, Missy Empire Cute. top, Missy Empire Cargirls, Nike Air Force Ones and Grandis Wardrobe. I think it's from Ego, isn't it? Yes, honey. Ego, Ego. 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 Cute. And this is my outfit. I'm wearing ASOS Cargirls, the ASOS top and yeah, that's it all. And, and Jordans. Hi guys, right. my top is from PLT. Cute. Lena Charles from PLT. Trainers from like, Converse. Yeah, back from PLT and yeah. <laughs> We are headed to Manchester. I got a burrito bowl. So I'm eating that on the train. Oh my god, it smells so good. Um, but yeah, we're headed to Manchester tonight. We're going to a day party. One of our really good friends, Mixamo, he throws these amazing day parties. So we're going today to support, and it just should be like a lot of fun. So yeah, that's the vibe for this evening. I love Manchester. Manchester is such a vibe. So I'm really ready to have like the best night. So yeah, let's go, besties. Hey, besties. We just landed in Manchester City. It's now time for us to head to our hotel room. Let's go. just arrived in the room let me give you guys a little tour it's really cute actually so we entered the room the bathroom is here oh, super clean clean and cute the little toilet is over there i like it i like how it's just like simple minimal lovely come into the room we have a little wardrobe in case you want to unpack not that we will because it's literally one night here we have the room cute and simple 
she's nice i like little pops of oranges actually I have a tv here we have a mirror here this is my little traveling fit i feel like this has become my go-to traveling fit just like a black tracksuit jordans because of alice cole that's my vibe my vibe is black tracksuits um we have a little circular mirror oh it's a little bit of a view pretty cute not too shabby but yeah this is the room our plan is to meet up at seven o'clock and then just have a little vibe before we head out so that's the plan right now it's like quarter past five so we actually have a decent amount of time to get ready for once which is quite nice usually we're always rushing around like maniacs <laughs> but to be fair i say that and then i feel like time will just disappear so I might just start getting ready right now and then yeah should be a good night Guys, whenever I discover like a new artist or like new songs, I'm literally obsessed. Like, like I'm the person that if I find a new song, I just rinse and repeat it until, until, I don't know, for like three months straight. Like, so I've discovered this new artist. Well, it's not a new artist. He's actually, I think he was a producer. Young John, like Young John, wicked producer. Like I'd always heard his like tag on other songs. I think now he's making music. I look crazy. <laughs> I think now he's making music and I'm literally obsessed. Like, there's a few of his songs that I'm literally obsessed with. If you like Afro beats, you guys will probably like it too. So I'll tell you the names of it. Next to you, Extra Cool. And if you leave, guys, check out those songs if you like Afro beats because I'm literally obsessed. But yeah, I'm just gonna be vibing and doing my makeup. And then I'll catch up with my gorgeous girls in a few minutes. In a few minutes, in like, let's see how long it's gonna take me. Right now it's quarter past six. We're supposed to be ready for seven. That gives me 47 minutes. I can definitely be done in 47 minutes. So yeah, let's get ready, besties. I have a drink, I have some music. I'm just gonna chill out and have a nice little get ready set. And um, I don't know when it was, but I think the other day I told you guys that I saw Only Baz's makeup hack when she like conceals in her like, I don't know, dark areas, I guess, before she actually puts foundation on top. I did it yesterday and oh, my makeup was amazing. So I'm gonna do it again today. But I think this is the new, the new pattern for me. Commandy like zombie Go down on me Oh, we chuck a cup body Follow my command Hi, so we're now ready for the night Glam is super pretty Now it's time to get dressed Let's go Ooh, And she's breath Z I'm sorry, but this look is Gaming wedding me stay guy It's gaming wedding me stay guy <laughs> But yeah, I really love this little two piece. It's from Missy Empire, and I'm wearing it with these boots. The face is facing, the little hairs are hairy. I'm not sure if you guys do this, but when it comes to me, like, I just like to layer all my scents. Like, so for this smash the trip, I took literally every single perfume, well, not every single one I own, but a bunch of perfumes that I own. None of them have lids because it's me. That's just me as a person. And I even have this oil oud, which is just so good. And I love it because like, I put it in my hair, I put it on my neck, I put it like on my body. So this is the first layer that I'll do. Rub that in. Mm, so it's smelling good. And then I layer with another scent. I just want to be that girl who walks past and you're like, oh my god, what was that? Like, like an attack, a fragrance. That's what I'm trying to do. And then I spray my other scent. This is like another oud. This was a present for my babes, and it's actually almost done, so I'm sad. But like, I just want to stink. I want to stink of perfume. You know, you know. Because I feel like, like gradually throughout the night, of course, it's gonna wear off. But as for right now, I want to just be immersed. But yeah, I literally just, just lay every single scent. If anyone asks me, like, what are you wearing? I'm wearing. I'm like, girl, I'm wearing like five different scents. But yeah, that's my vibe. I just want to smell like so damn good. And typically, I always like to take something out with. Me. Oh, <gasps> bro. I don't know why I just did that. I just put my oil on my top, and now I have yellow stain. Don't know if you can see that, but that's just not cute but who even cares so yeah i think i smell bomb i, I watched a video from um jackie aina and she said she puts her perfume in like her lower car so i'm gonna even do that too why not like why the heck not so yeah i'm officially ready for the night let's go and join the girls
It's now time to check out of the hotel room. We are out of here. This is my outfit of the day. I actually really like it. I wear this cold all the time. The outfit's actually styled by Jay Marie's brand. I live in nude. I love this cold so much. Bring it my because of Alice coat. Little bag, little Jordans. But yeah, this is the fit. We have to get out of here. It's time to check out. Let's go. Morning, girls. How is everybody? <laughs> we're alive hey guys we're going through so much right now all we want to do is have brunch that's all we want and we can't because there's literally a queue <clears throat> there's a queue around the block i did not know a brunch place would be this popular on a monday morning like do y'all not have jobs do y'all not that's literally what i said do y'all like not have a place to be right now that you're all here why are you here then <laughs> I mean, I'm on annual leave. <laughs> yeah, guys, this is clearly the hot spot yeah. of the town. The car popping is outside, so inside it's a myth. And it's not even warm for people to be sitting outside. Like, So we're currently on the hunt for a new place to go to because this place is chock a block. To be fair, it is a really, really, a really good brunch. So that's probably why. Okay, we found an alternative. It's looking so cute. We just arrived guys and we're I think a bit underdressed because people out here is so pretty though. We've had further developments guys. We came here because we wanted um, breakfast but they've now stopped breakfast. So we're leaving again. On the we're road not, again. We're not in the mood for their menu. Like it's giving chicken schnitzel, it's giving steak, it's yeah. giving Devon crab. You don't want steak at 11 a.m. We don't you know? want that. That's not the no. vibe. I wanted a nice brunchy Frenchy vibe. Yeah. So yeah, we're gonna literally pack our load and be on our merry way. Um, <laughs> we just need to find load. somewhere else. Again, this place is freaking stunning though. Yeah. It's literally beautiful. I would come here on a date. Yeah, this is date night. Mm. Super date night. Cute vibe. <laughs> and then you can and then you can have like a steak. Yeah. You know. With your main. Mama, we made it. But thank God. There's a table being prepared for us. Hey guys, so we're now back from Manchester, back from a super fun lit weekend with my besties. But yeah, we had a lot of fun. If you guys watched until the end of this vlog, please comment this emoji and then I'll know that you're a real one. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. It literally means the world to me. I hope you have an amazing day. Bye. Mwah. Bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop, format it, touch it, bring it, pay it, watch it, turn it, leave it, stop, format it.